Okay, we're back again this week. Let's get everything set up here. My shadows off me and my lighting correct. Make sure I look all beautiful. Uh oh, I'll turn off my lighting. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. What, what's up, what's, what's up, going what's up? on? What's hey, what's hey, going on? Just before we start, I'm just gonna say this whatever you had last week. Yeah. I think you gave it to me this week because I am sick as a dog. Bro, I always share, <laughs> man. I share everything I got. Oh, man. man. I, I had no idea this was included once we became friends, man. You, you, <laughs> you forgot to mention that. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm i I'm still sick. You know, I, I haven't got over it yet. So it, yeah, no. Rough, I, we're, we're, thank goodness it's not COVID or any of that stuff, but... I've been I've been taking these uh, Tylenol yeah. um, uh, cold and flu medicine and holy heck, these nighttime ones knock me <laughs> out. <laughs> you're, you're <so laughs> I feel like boy. crap. I, I literally just woke up from a nap. Holy hell! Man, it was brutal, man. I, it kept me down all week last weekend. I, I'm. I'm I'm up and going, but I like uh, very congested and stuff like that. Yeah. But at least my voice is back. I mean, I felt. Uh, anyways, I'm so sorry, man. Yeah, I, please I'll, I'll don't, don't spread them germs over here anymore, man. I I would appreciate it. <laughs> I just really I really like you, dude. We got really close over the over the right? past few weeks here. Oh, that's hilarious. So. so what's good? Just hanging out, just chilling what's out. Up? Oh well, we gotta just let everybody know. Um, so five ten bubbles. Uh, Mark, he's actually. Um, coaching the game real quick, so he's gonna be on at a later time. Um, so he will be in though, guys. He will be in. I was gonna let no! him go, <laughs> but <laughs> right, his, his, his looks, man, his looks. Young. He was uh way too beautiful for all for for both of us. <laughs> so we got a lot of people coming in. I see Andy. What's up, Andy? Let's get this thing going. Uh, what's up, Val and P? What's up, man? We got Poco Bobbles in here. We got the we got Nick Bobbles, Mike, Mike, Jeff. Thanks to everybody hopping on and joining us tonight. Um, what's up, Brian Peck? Oh, there's a wife. She's in here too. I had to show her how to wave on one of the uh, one of your your live your uh, your uh, uh, live feed you're doing there. So there you go. we got seven or fours good, in though. here. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, dude. So. What's been good, man? I know um, we don't have a guest this week. We kind of had to shift plans a little bit, so it's going to be a little bit of a... I think it might be a little bit of a yeah, yeah, no. type of show this time. No, I mean, well, there's uh, a lot of exciting, great things coming up. Uh, opening day happened, man. Opening freaking day happened. And then right. for right. us here with the Dodgers, we have opening day on Thursday, which I, I will be there at that game. Uh, it's going to be freaking amazing. I can't wait. And then our first for the for for Dodgers, we have our first bobblehead giveaway coming up um, on Saturday. So yeah, I'm super stoked about it. I just re- it's, it's funny because I was talking to Dodger Ralphie about it. He's like, "Man, are you gonna be there at the game on Saturday?" I'm, yeah, I'll be there. But then my wife just reminded me. She was like, uh, "No, we gotta go to Vegas uh, for Mother's Day weekend." I'm like, "Crap!" So now I'm thinking, "Who's gonna go to the game for me? Who's gonna pick up my bobblehead?" So I'm sure I'm gonna figure it out. But uh, yeah, I already had buying tickets for the game. Yeah. But uh, definitely, yeah, it's gonna be a, a great game yeah. for sure. Yeah, we don't get our okay. opening day till next Monday, um, uh, and we still yeah. don't have any bobbleheads. I think the though. I think the Angels just gave out some uh, some Otani bobbleheads uh, um, just recently. I think that's like the yeah. first bobblehead uh, SGA that I've seen thus far. And I seen a bunch of people posting them for like about thirty bucks out there. So I'm actually gonna have one of my boys uh, 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 give me a bobblehead on, on reserve. So I'm gonna send him some some little cash right after the show. Yeah, I'm gonna get mine secured. Hey, that's tight. We had a guy uh, from up here he, from the Oakland group. He went down, uh, drove down, and went back up. That's right. Well, uh, 704. He, he stopped by my place. I hooked them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was like, oh, yeah, it, was, yeah. it was amazing. He hit me up. He was like, um, you know, he, he's trying to uh, collect the whole entire uh, bobblehead set for the SGAs or whatever. And uh, yeah, I came, he came through and uh, I showed him some love and I'm going to continue to show him some love. And 
That's going to be good stuff. Yeah. Yeah, great dude, man. Great dude. I we I, I got you know become friends with him over you know the past few years and stuff up here. And like I said, he always says it's for his wife, but he, he's a little open. <laughs> so don't let him fool you. With yeah, that. we'll see. Uh, and then I see uh, I see uh, Chipper said uh, Chipper Allen said that uh, first break nice. New Year's tonight to Austin Riley. Yeah, okay, so Austin cool, Riley. Man. Okay, okay, something like that's good. Uh, yeah, exactly. 704 said pick it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Must yeah. Be the ones from you, huh? What's that? Like yeah, he, like, he, well, he left with two trash bags uh, full of bobbleheads and then like a little <laughs> mini bag of uh, bobbleheads. And I, I give him a, you know, something a little extra on the side um, just to kind of help him out with the set. But not a great guy. I, I he was he was literally 30, 30 minutes away from me and he hit me up and it was late at night and I'm like. You, you down to pull up? He's like, yeah, I'll pull up. I was like, all right, let me put some stuff together for you then. And yeah, so. But well, I'm down in your neck of the woods. I'm going to bring down that. Uh, you can make some room for, I got a Modelo four footer. I got to bring uh, that with the, uh, with the, like the Dia de los Mortes ones and stuff like really? that. Really? down when I come down next time. Oh. Oh, yeah, man. It's just back in, the, in my storage, and I don't got anywhere to put it. So I'll yeah, let's do it. Let's do place, it. Bro. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. It was, so what's good? Do you have any, uh, any, uh, any, any new bobbleheads for for this week? No, I mean, with, just a couple. Uh, I, I posted up one um, that I had shared um, the, earlier today. I posted up a little mini. Um, what do you call a mascot? Mascot Bobble Bros, and I saw you're talking. No, we didn't get one. Didn't get one, right? Yeah, so it's a cool little piece. We were talking about it with uh, with the um, uh, the uh, um, with Foco, and they asked him like, you know, how what's kind of reception on this, and what do you guys like this and stuff? And I don't know what is the you know what's the chat thing because I, I they're pretty cool. They're good little stocking stuffers. Like you're saying, you know, I don't know, if, or you know, like little gifts or whatever. I don't know if they're like uh, gonna, you know, a big time collector type thing, but they're good, you know, good little piece and set on your desk and everything else. And uh, yeah, I, I think well, personally, well like made. something like that would be good for like the kids. So like, if the kids ever wanted something, like, so I have my son. He has a. He was born in Vegas, so he has like a little uh, mini uh, Vegas okay. night bobblehead, the one that kind of like sits or whatever as well. Um, and that's his bobblehead, and he yeah. knows that that's his. And like, and if he breaks it, that's on him. I think those pieces, like I and I, like and as I was writing, I'm like, ooh, I kind of cringed. I'm like, if those break, I don't think too many yeah. collectors would be upset about it. I know I would be up upset about it, yeah. but I mean, th yeah, those are definitely would be right. a, a good, you know, stocking stuffer, uh, good little gifts to give away to like other people that um you know don't know so much about the hobby and great 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 gifts for kids you know so um you know putting something under the christmas tree for them and if you guys are a bobblehead collector kind of like you know us being parents and the kids were to see something like that and like my kid's five so if he were to see something like that he'd go crazy over it so yeah, yeah. no i i agree with you and that came from the bobblehead that came from the bobblehead hall which is pretty cool you know what i mean because that that little connection there but i i I agree with you. It's very good for a kid. They, I, you know, I, I'll collect it. I mean, I don't. I mean, I'm Oakland, so we don't yeah. get hardly shit anyway. So, so it definitely goes in my. But I have, and then the other one, I got, and that actually reminded me. Let's see if I can find the other stomper. Oh, it reminded me of this. Is that the one that they give away at the stadium? No, it's this little guy, and I don't know what they called these, but it's another one from Foco. Uh, I think from the hall too. I forgot what they were called, but they're pretty similar. In oh, size. those are pretty cool. Bit, yeah, those are neat. A little different. You know, I, I'll be, yeah, yeah I'll be honest. Like, if they had like a mini set of the Dodger dogs like that, I, I'd buy it for sure. And I think a lot of uh, Dodger collectors would uh, definitely jump on that as well. Yeah, you know what? Not even bad would be like a little, a little, uh, uh, Yep. Mascot set. You know what I mean? It'd be kind of cool if they did. I don't know, but I don't kind of like they did WWE. The other one I got, um, again, now this one's different. I don't know. I don't know if this, I don't know much about these. So oh. Up, and these are the little, these are the little show, show yeah, stompers, yeah, yeah, yeah. Show stompers. And uh, so, so I know, I know what they are, and this is a Chapman one. 
I don't know how many were made and how many is released. I don't know. So this came from Clark's Toys. Um, and they actually popped up on eBay and they have them on the website yeah. too, but they didn't have very many of these. So I don't know if they had like a small batch of these made or what's going on, but uh, there may be a couple still left, but there was only like four yeah. left or three or four left. And somebody told me about them and there was like 10 left. And then on the website, there was like a dozen but there's a lot of less of those. I, I saw that. Too, uh, so. I, I saw. I saw the hall and has some right now of uh, what, Justin hall. Turner, or something like that. Yeah, so they have some right now. Okay. Okay. Well, I don't know about yeah. this one because I mean he's gone. Yep. You know he's in Toronto now, and so uh, I, I don't know what's up if if this was like a little batch they made <laughs> and it, you know they stopped making. I don't know. I don't know much about it, but uh, Bay, Bay Area Bobble Grapher uh, said still didn't learn with not having white cleats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know. I know. I already gave him a little bit. I, I already talked to you. Uh, I, I gave Foco a little ribbon on that, too. And I guess they got away with it on the uh, on the stompers because the stop stomp show stompers because the yep. you know, little two tone cleat there. But yeah, I know. But you know what's weird about that? So I was thinking about that on the stop on the uh, on the stomper itself. The actual stomper back in the day had black cleats. So I have to stop myself a little bit before I um, before I get to you know harass them too much because there's mm. pictures with stompers with black cleats. That's cool. So, yeah. Anyway. Yeah, I know they're not they're not numbered, uh, Foco, but but I I just feel like there wasn't many of these made though because it just seemed like I don't know and I don't know where they're all coming out of. But anyways, they're not very many yeah. of these. I don't think. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um. Other than that, uh, I had a little. Now this is kind of, kind of funny and everything else. I had a little. So we have like a weekly flea market here in town, and uh, and at the, they have like yard sales when they have the flea market and stuff like that. So I stopped by a little thing on the way because on the way to the office, I picked up. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> Yeah, so they're not a male dad. That's freaking funny. That's right awesome. There, right there. That's awesome. <laughs> I love it. I love it. <laughs> so, other than that, that's pretty much my male. Yo, we got 510 in the house. Uh, Who's going on 510? Oh, uh, uh, there we go. There we go. Is he going to ask the joint or what? There we go. We got him on there. So, yeah, the little a Ace and Gary. Uh, that's freaking awesome. There, going on. Yeah. What's going oh, on? What's up? I'm just, I'm just sliding. I'm just sliding oh. at my baseball game. How was yeah. the game? You just, dude, so you slide me. Someone knocked me over and I got, and I got, <laughs> and I got Nailed that. It. Oof. He got. I, I did die yes. in the face. He got yes. a raspberry on his elbow and he said, he comes in the dugout and he's like, Dad, I yes. got a cherry blossom. No. <laughs> 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 oh, that's awesome. I, how are we doing, boys? Uh, it's, uh, good. I uh, you missed the you missed the uh, Ace and Gary. Oh my! Hey, that's not for your eyes. Yeah. Get out uh, of yeah. here. <laughs> yeah, that's not for you. What's the story behind that? Wiener guard. Wiener guard. I had a, had a little yard sale in town, man. Stop by and I saw Bro. the gym right there on the table. And they for dude, it was a buck, dude. I mean, the head. I'm surprised the young lady on, but hey, that up before you got there. I can't even wow. believe that this gym was just still sitting Very there, nice. dude. I mean, it's real. Congrats on your the craftsmanship, on that trail, dude. <laughs> uh, on my mail day, M A L D, yeah. Matthew Zerg. Yep, the mo <laughs> the model has arrived. <laughs> About time. My. I, uh, my well, you're, he was at, you're a true gentleman, Mike. Thank you. He, he, said, he says he was out <laughs> coaching his son's baseball game, but he was out there modeling for the women. Yeah, right. Come on. I know. You guys know how I roll. <laughs> <laughs> What's cracking? Just go. No, then we're just digging through the – digging through. Uh, we talked about the little uh, the little show stompers. I mean, not sure. The, these, the, the these are the bubble. Buddies. Yeah, the bubble bros. Yeah, the bubble bros. Bro, the, yep. the mascot bobble bros. These cute little dudes. Yeah, I love yeah there yes, you go. Sir. And there's a show stompers on that. I didn't. I didn't even get a full bobble head. Yeah, week. just got through that. I got a bunch of stuff. I'm like, <laughs> my. I, I have to go through my stuff all over again. Can just reorganize everything. 
You guys saw my 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 closet. How how oh my god! It's bro. We can't it, keep up, a, dude, dude. I can't keep up. I can't keep up with me. <laughs> every so, time, uh, I, every time I check Instagram, <laughs> you're you're going live to do another unboxing. Like, it's bro. <laughs> oh no! I I, I I am not gonna do another twenty four hour stream in a, in a very long time. I don't know how I even survived that. How are you guys uh, feeling? I feel like crap. Uh, whatever, whatever uh, uh, Rob had last week, I have it now. Yeah, I just coughed Typical. through the phone. But uh, I got my oh, first God. knuckle and my first big head. They're they're not they're they're not Dodgers, but oh, yeah. so uh, I got this uh, CC Sabathia. Nice. Yeah, it's clean. Now 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 I now that I have something that is like you know of this type of bobblehead. I, I'm I've been looking everywhere and I'm hooked and I'm trying to get something at a reasonable price to where it's not gonna break the the piggy bank, you know? Hey. So what so it, it's not a ball question, but it's a CC Sabathia question. Is C C Sabathia is a Hall of Famer, right? I believe so. I mean well, we're never yeah, gonna yeah. see we're yeah, never gonna see the like traditional three hundred win or get in again right he's got to get in i think yeah i know i agree i and, and you know it helps being on the yankees too you know what i mean but i agree and, you know long career you know everything he, to me he it's kind of he's kind of what the stand yeah. is now for starting Andy yeah uh i i think he gets in that guy was that guy was dominant dude for a long period of time yep oh yeah it's forever. Hey, hey on that knucklehead, hey, are there I believe, yeah, I believe so. I believe you know? so. I think there there are some. There's several of them. So uh, I I I so the, there's a there's a handful of people that I go through their page to kind of see um what bobbleheads are out there um that uh, I you know peak peak my interest um there's F Bravo or the Dodger historian um he I go through his page and I kind of just you know browse for hours um there's Carrillo. Hey, shout out to him. Oh, he's yeah. been more than helpful to me. He he's helped me on some other things that I, I didn't even like necessarily like. You know, I I don't mean the bug, you know, because some people some people either you're invading their space, you know. What I mean, you know, I'm collecting world, you know. What I mean, but man, I I want to say thank you to him. I don't know if he's even he, on right now, but man, he's, he's a man. worth uh, of not he's like they, it's insane how much information he has in his head. And not only just his head, and like in the amount of, of time that he's able to do the research as well, in such a you know short amount of time, like if he doesn't have an answer, he'll find it for you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and he cares. I mean, like legit, like is that that was what was so cool to me? Is like, uh, dude, like he was yeah. had the same enthusiasm that I had. Yeah. And I, and I appreciated that, and so I, um, and I didn't even have to like. I don't know. It's another one of those friendships, you know, you make that like where you can get. I don't know. I just wanted to. It, He'll be on it, later. It's probably not on right now, but but I want to. Yeah, I want to say thank you to him. And then if anybody, I would go to him. Another resource I would think to talk yep. to about stuff and ask questions. Um, you know, it, 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 all three of us, we I think we're very good at answering. You know, <laughs> uh, talking to people. Okay, not necessarily, not necessarily <laughs> the model, but uh, yeah. Yeah, Mike. I know, Mike. And I'm sorry, Mike. I actually, I was doing yeah. answers on some other stuff. I've been a little bit. I was. I feel like crap last week. So this is the only knucklehead uh. that I have, and Bobby Crosby, and this is the only one. I have. So that's why. I have, and I don't think there's very many knuckleheads overall. Um, uh, so that's why I was. We, we do have. I mean, we have obviously the the newer newer ones that came out. But I think uh, like some of the knuckleheads that I've seen out there, like the Eric Gagne one. I think. Um, Crap! What else? Um, I can't even think right now. But I know for sure, like old school wise, is like uh, there's like some some Eric Gagne ones. Uh, then like the newest ones that came out were like the Mookie Betts and I think uh, Kershaw or whatnot. So we have we do have knuckleheads, you know, like more recent ones. Um, or I, I don't know if they're big heads, but I, we we have them, you know. And then like uh, and then like with yeah no they're, they're yeah, knuckleheads. And then like with these big heads. The person that I've only seen like with the, with an entire set, but I I'm sure they have them out there. Uh, I've seen. I don't know if you guys follow F Salinas on 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 uh, Instagram. So, so res- yeah. my my utmost respect to this man. Um, 
I, I've told him countless time over and over and over how much I respect his hustle, how much I respect everything that he does. You know, and you know he's always trying to uh, help people out as well with their collections. Um, you know, and he's like a, he's a, he's a big flipper. You know, he's like one of the biggest flippers that I've seen um, out there. And I, I respect his hustle, man. And a lot of the collection that he has, it's like it's top notch stuff. And I, I would definitely love to have him on the show one day. I don't know if he uh, is watching us, but I'm gonna reach out to him one day to see if he can, we can get him on here as well. Um, I think he's a very underrated person on Instagram, and I think he's definitely one of those uh, collectors that um, a lot more people should should uh, definitely link up with. Yeah, yeah, I, uh, yeah, I, I agree with you, and uh, it, yeah, I'd love to get him on. I mean, if we can. Uh, uh, so I late so you know I I bitch and bitch about the age <laughs> so I need to stop doing that because what yeah. it, it is is what it is right so so the problem is I find myself yep. looking at other stuff right I actually considered trying to build a, like an yep. overall set of big heads like just getting everybody you know every team and everything else I think I look pretty sweet I think that'd be a really amazing yep. set and just start collecting them and. And you know, do it like in an affordable way. Yeah. You know, I mean, I, you know, don't just nope. start going and trying to grab all the, you know. All the Dodger like, stuff man, is is amazing. expensive. It's super pricey, and like, uh, it, yeah, it, it, and, and uh, like, you know, like I, I am trying to 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 collect them, but obviously the for me the the deterring factor is is price, man. So. If it's something that I really like and I really want, I'll, I'll, I'll get it. But if it's something where it's like, I, I know I can wait and get a, get it a, a different time, then I, I definitely would do that. Um, but yeah. Yeah. And Nick, and Nick asked football and basketball too. I think that I, maybe. I mean, I don't know how many there are. I mean, I does anybody have any idea? Like, an, a ball I know we have, I know we have Foco yeah, in the I mean, house. I mean, I know. Yeah, see, even Foco agrees. Foco says that uh, Salinas Dodger uh, his big head set is wild. Yeah, and they're all signed. Yeah, saw- that's the crazy part. It's like even to get them all signed as well. Yeah. It's like, yo, props to that guy, man. Um, and that would be amazing. Those would be amazing looking signs. There's a, there's so a big, nice, yeah, nice look. Check this out. Look. And uh, it, it, speaking of uh, uh, big heads, uh, we we did receive uh, a, a little birdie told us that the big heads are locked in. Um, however, yeah, yeah, th- those are coming out. Those are coming out uh, by Foco. Uh, there's a new set. Um, they don't really know uh, when other launch dates are going to happen, um, uh, but it'll, it'll be players and mascots for all leagues, and uh, they'll most uh, likely start after the All Star game. So keep out for that, guys. We're definitely. I, I, I can't wait. I definitely can, cannot wait. Oh, I, 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 I love I. I don't know. I don't know why I like them so much because some of their some of the poses are a little repetitive, but I just love. Them. I just think that some of yeah. the coolest things out there. But, yeah, do we have Mark you know, like but... loading up for? Hey, yeah, I, I thought he requested to join again. I just missed that. Sorry. I'm trying. Okay, to get cool. I'm trying to get. So, um, I actually have uh, a couple more things that I want to show off. If if we're all we're all good, so. <laughs> <laughs> we got no yeah so uh um, there you go, go welcome ahead. back welcome back welcome back i'm back sorry all right cool so um all right, good. you know you know as, as a collector um you know all the stuff that we purchased from foco i was so pissed off and i i, I don't mind being honest because i'm pretty sure this is the the overall um um, you know, same feeling with a lot of people when we receive uh, our stuff at a later time. And, you know, I have these Max Scherzer bobbleheads that, you know, came in way after he's already gone. He's already with the Mets or whatever. And uh, I was like, honestly pissed off about it that I didn't receive it anytime sooner. But then as soon as I got it, all those feelings went away. I, I'm, I'm, I'm serious. Like all those, you know, we got Dodger Ralphie. Hey, what's going on? Um, all those feelings yeah, went exactly. away, and now, like, I, I look at it, and, and I'm not mad that I I waited this long. Like this this piece right here, it, it is it is oh my god, it is yeah. insane, it, and it's a and, Ed, and it's and it's a big everybody. piece. It's not a, a it's not a tiny, you know. I actually like this one a lot better than than the LeBron James one. Like, I, I not I mean. 
this is this is sick. Like I I love the the one that they did for LeBron James, but but this one is like holy right. hell, like the amount of de- the the it, no, ninety dollars. You know the the amount of detail that they put into this bobblehead, and then just like every, the eye colors are different in every single head, you know, which is awesome. And then just like, I mean, right. it, it, I don't know, I, I can't say anything negative about it. You know, this a three K strikeouts or whatever. It's like it says right there in the bottom of the plate or whatever, or the the base rather. And what kind of got me even more happier is that I got four of three hundred and eleven. Of 300 so i'm like you know what wow i gotta stop you know being a being a little little you know chihuahua about it and uh <laughs> and uh, no it, it, this is a this is a great piece and if anybody missed out on it i i i'm gonna say it right now I'm like you guys missed out on a, on a great piece this this thing is amazing yeah that that's that's really cool i i like i see i see a couple of people with it it just you know, I I love the 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 dual pieces and everything else, but like that four and all those, they're all like regular size, right? Or maybe slightly. Uh, slightly no, this is regular size, man. Exactly. Like, check it out. Yeah. So let me pull out a, I don't know what's regular next to me right here. So speaking of Scherzer, so here here's another Scherzer, right? This is a SGA, and um, okay. They're they're definitely bigger than a, a Yankees bobblehead. I'll tell you that right now. Please be careful. Oh yeah, yeah. See, yeah. I I I, I love. That. I can't I, complain. I, I, would, I yeah. can't complain at all. Like it's for bobblehead, and for the price for ninety bucks, I, I'm not. I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna stop complaining about it. You know. So, you know what though? On the on the complaining thing, I agree with you. Like, I mean, I think we all complain, and then when we get it, we're for the most part, we're usually happy. I will say, and I, I think I told you guys this week, um, like, you know, we, we know the bobble, it sounds like the bobble on parade for the all-star game is going to come back. And I saw a tweet, I think it was a tweet or maybe it's an Instagram post. I don't know, but they were like, Foco was asking for suggestions on what it should look like. And on something like that, I was like, as soon as it like that popped up, it, like immediately in my mind, I'm like, Dude, you know the date of the All Star Game way ahead of time. You know the location. You know, like that would be one that you should be that I wish they were like pre ordering right now. Yep. So that come July 13th or whatever the All Star date is this year, we can have those in hand. Because it, I don't know. Sometimes it's just like like when I got my ball was on parade last year. It was freaking awesome. I love that thing. But it it kind of sucked that it was like I think it was after the World Series. Off to you. And, and it's like, right, it was awesome. I just think it would be way cooler. Now, some of those, some of them, like, a lot of the bobbleheads right now from FOCO are just, like, in the moment. So you can't, you can't pre-order the, you can't, uh, you know, foresee the future. But on some, like, the Bobbles on Parade, or I know they do the, um, the NHL, yes. NHL All-Star on Parade now. Like, those kind of things, if you could have them ready to ship for the game, that would be dope. Yeah. Yeah, I 100% agree with you. Even because the, they got the the guitars yeah. right now too, yeah. right for the NBA. Yeah, see, they're saying here we're trying to work on getting more cut down the amount of yeah, yeah. But it, yeah, but I agree on that one. That one kind of was. I agree with you on that one. That one could have been yeah pre pre planned. No, but I mean, yeah. I, I and here's the thing, and like I I think personally, like it's a double edged sword on both ends, uh, because then I so look, I'm a business major. I. I I know business and I know what, you know, overhead and all that stuff and pre-planning and what that goes into. Um, so I get it from the, the business side of, of FOCO. But then again, as a collector, and I've said this time and time again, I get it as well from a collector standpoint. We want something in hand. We want something right there and then. We don't want to wait months on end. And when, you know, the, the hype and the excitement's already over, is done with, it's like, okay, you know, what are we going to do with this bobblehead? Like um like the next stop bobbleheads for uh Trey Turner and Max Scherzer like th- those are the ones I'm like I I, I would have wish I would have had in hand but then again like who can predict something like that you know and yeah. but then again and if you look at it it's like one of those things where you have to still give an appreciation for the thought process that does go behind making these bobbleheads and having them you know you know yeah, right yeah. there for you and once you do get them like I said with this Max Scherzer thing I, I I'm not mad anymore. 
I'm, I'm very, very content with it. But no, no, Mark, to your point, I, I still agree with you 100%. There's some things that definitely um, um, could be pre-planned and, and worked on for like future events and stuff like that. Yeah. Here's where... Hey, look. Look, I'm a drum major and I like to parade. Dude. Yeah, those, like are, no, those are nice. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just saying. Here's the, the flip side of it for me and, and maybe it's just like my crazy mind. I don't know, but... Um, when I pre-order something, like I, I kind of like, like I might, I might complain or bitch about like what's taking so long or where is this thing, but I kind of really enjoy the anticipation that it builds. And it's not, not to say that I'm disappointed once it finally comes, but like once it finally comes, you're like, all right, I'm just gonna stick in this cabinet now and, and you know, put take a picture of it and put it on Instagram. <laughs> and I'm done with it, kind of, you know, like. I do, I do kind of like. Really hey, but just know, changes. just know that they always come, all right? Just know that. You hope. <laughs> I, I've had stuff not yeah. come up before, but yeah. Oh dang, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> but. Yeah, no, I would get it, Foco. I, I know that the, the except with the COVID and everything, I, I knew the factories and stuff like. I, and we don't, and like I said, most of the stuff like the in the moments and stuff, it doesn't bother me. You know what I mean? Or even the the. The change in it, what do you call it when they change the team? But anyway, that that none of those really bothered me. I don't mind in that. It just we were just yeah. kind of brainstorming on that. Uh, so I got some more stuff to show yeah. off. Um, so I, <laughs> I got a, a, a Nat set. So I got a, a freaking Victor Robles bobblehead. I, got, I have another Trey Turner bobblehead. Hey, so so then. So that's a national piece. So how you guys like those, those uh, the city jersey ones? Do you know what I mean? You seen the, the new national ones and the with the cherry blossom and stuff like that? That's pretty sweet, dude. I love. Them. I love them. I think. Yeah, I love the hats. I love everything about the whole thing. I I would I would buy a Washington national. I, uh, hat, which I like that damn hat. I saw the the no, nationals right. came out. No, no, we're just talking about the nationals. I'm sorry. The Astros just came out with. Yep. Them, and I haven't seen yeah, the yeah, bobblehead yeah. yet. Uh, I don't think anybody's seen that yet, but um, the Nationals uniform I think is way cooler looking than the Astros, personally. Yep. And that's not just because I hate oh, the Astros. Oh, the Astros but, like the well, team. let's get this one yeah. out of the way then, since the Astros uh, uh, were on the topic of the cheaters. I mean, <clears throat> the Astros. Um, the last, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, their City Connect. They're going to launch um, when they wear their, their jerseys on the field as well. So. That's gonna be pretty cool, with with the uh, with, with Foco. They're gonna launch some some stuff with, with yeah, them. I, it? I mean, they're cool. It's, I mean, it actually. When I saw the Astros jersey the other day drop, um, the color of the jersey reminded me of the Dodgers uh, from last year. And when the Dodgers came out and played in that jersey, I was like, "Oh, that's terrible. I don't like it at all." But on the bobblehead, it looked. Oh, cool. the bobblehead's yeah. sick, man. They're, they're sick. They look dope. Oh, yeah. So I mean, I'm sure the Astros is gonna. I mean, those that that dark navy and the orange, it's gonna pop. Yeah. But I really the Astro or the Nationals that came out so far. That's nice. yeah, yeah. I that, I love it. And then we we were talking with Poco, right? The the Red Sox. Yeah. Yep. They're being added. They're gonna continue right? the series from last year as well. Yep. I can't wait for the A's to get something. Going. I think next, Man, I like I think next season that. they're on no. Rob, yeah. if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, well, what are we going to get? We don't even know what player. Stomper, bro. Where, where are we going to get? Uh, Chad Pinder. Right. Yeah. Uh, and Foco also, Foco also let us know, Seth too, though, that uh, as soon as the Astros wear their jerseys, whenever that day is, that's when their bobbleheads are going to start dropping. Yep. So that's coming soon, too. We just haven't seen them yet. So uh, I, I did want to share my last mail day. Um, I, I still have more stuff, but I think this would be a pretty good one to talk about. So there's Duke Snyder, St. Paul Saints uh, bobblehead. Um, now how many? Of those uh, so I already had best one, best? and then I ended up I ended up getting three more. <laughs> um, so the story nice. behind these bobbleheads right here is that apparently the game. Um, was ringed out so it was uh, scheduled for a next game a lot of the, the the people that had tickets to the game ended up receiving a voucher for the game or a voucher rather for the bobblehead okay. so um 
they never gave the bobblehead out. So people had to collect them. So a lot of people didn't, did, they never collected this bobblehead. Um, so it's not a really rare piece, but it's rare to find it in the box. And I have. Now why? Why is it? I wish I could tell you, rare? but I don't know. I've 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 seen and chased these bobbleheads for maybe three years now. Uh, yeah, yeah, two three years. I, I've been chasing this bobblehead, I believe, uh, roughly around that time, and I have yet to see one in the box. And then anyone that has bought it that I know, they've never seen the box. And then uh, this one, remember, came in broken. Remember, the bat was broken right here, and I had to glue it back on. So, and even with the bat right here, this always does come in broken. So I ended up getting three in very, very clean, pristine condition. And um, I'm very, very happy to say that uh, we're going to give one of these away on Bobble Talk. So um, that, that's going to come up pretty soon, guys. Uh, so any of, uh, I, don't, I don't care if you're a Dodger collector or not. I think as a bobblehead collector, this is a cool piece to, to have in your collection. Oh, yeah, man. That's I beautiful. Win. I love it. It's a good looking bobblehead. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> so, I did get one. I did get one, and um, I, I had to get a regular piece. I actually got two pieces, and I didn't talk about it yet. But uh, um, I did get another. Hey, uh, let's go. Nice. Let's go. And uh, so this is one. The other one, like I said, I had the broken broken helmet on it, and this one doesn't have the broken nice. helmet. Nice. This is what they look like. It's a really nice. Piece. You know, I've been trying. Uh, you to you need and next time you see one, let me know so I can get it too. Because I've been trying to look for that one also. And this is the one you said. That may end up at your door. They're expensive, dude. Yeah. If, like on eBay, they're expensive. Well, if, 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 you really if you find if you find if you find one on uh, eBay, let me know. Okay, I may um I may no don't don't do that don't do that don't do that. I want to win one of your giveaways. <laughs> Right, <laughs> and then the other thing. So I don't know why I got a lot of like, for some reason a lot of. So we all we all have the big. I know I'm gonna bring this up, but we all have the big uh, the bottle. Yeah, bottle, that guy, right? But this is the little one. Yeah, they make a little yeah. one. I didn't know about the little. One. That looks huge. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. I got the little one. I, I ordered extra. I was going to give somebody, but this one's tiny. That's what This is not like the original one that I had. And people have seen it. I don't know. What, I'm sorry. It's so much like penis. It's stuff on like your mind like, today. Oh, How what's going on? You have something you want to say? I, I know. No. <laughs> I just, I got to put this, I got to put his sock back on here. But this is the original. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and and, oh. Blur it out. Blur it out. <laughs> Dude, I how do you keep a sock on that, that on, dude? But they, uh huh. But look, there's like two, like a little one, and a big one now. I didn't know they made the little one now. But anyways, so that's my mail day. I have the big one, have, yeah. I have the big, big one. one. It's it's somewhere in my pile of bobbleheads. I've got a big one. Yeah. It's much, it's much better than this, but anyways so they got the little ones now on the thing so and they still have the sock now on the little one can you remove the sock as well (laughs) yes you can (laughs) you're good at that (laughs) you're gonna have to blur you're gonna have to blur that when you post it on youtube yeah (laughs) this has two this has a tube sock and this one well i guess two sock but this one has stripes and this one does not have stripes so yeah there are very many questions mike i'm sorry this is what happens when we don't have a guest. This is the kind of crap that I bring up and kind of talk about. So it's just uh, stuff just that two I just two bros chilling in the sauna. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that's funny. So I want to bring that up to you guys. Uh, uh, Marky, no, yeah, the only thing I got this? this week was uh, was these two little guys, like we talked about already. And uh, I got a couple things coming. I'm not sure if they'll be here by next show either, but I got some things coming, so I'm excited for that. 
Yeah, I have uh, several pretty rare pieces coming in as well that I'm very excited about. Um, I'm not sure when they'll they'll be here, but I, I you guys are gonna freak out when you guys see it. It's gonna be pretty cool. So I, I got some stuff that uh, I almost won uh, multiple of them, um, and I paid a, a huh? Can we get a hint? No, I'll tell you guys off off the show, but uh. It, it's a it's a rare piece. Oh, okay, all right. I'll give you a hint. I'll give you I'll give you guys a hint. It's something that one of our one of our guests talked about having, and this piece was that person's rarest piece in his collection. And I and I I I, I almost won. I think it was four that I saw online, and I only won one because the price was way too much for me. Yeah. Hmm. I paid. I paid the price for this one. I didn't want to pay that much, but I I paid the price for sure. I have a guess, but I don't think it's. I actually don't think I'm right. Well, I'm not going to tell you the bobblehead, but it's a rare. Uh, it's a rare piece. But just think of. Think, if you want to look through, you know, our past guests and kind of look through the vods and and think to see which bobblehead will be, then we'll go from there. Now I'm excited. Maybe that'll be the question that we uh, give everyone, and uh, maybe that's how we do this giveaway for this uh, this yeah. this Saint this Duke Snyder. I don't know. We'll, we'll think of something. This is this is more exciting than Rob's I'm bobble okay. dicks. <laughs> I don't know. If, I don't know. If that's true. <laughs> I mean, that's a it's it's. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. That's, that's and you know what? Thing. You know what's interesting that I've seen this bobblehead go for way yeah. less, and I had no idea what it was. Um, and I've seen it go for like twenty, thirty bucks. And what's crazy is that after the show uh, aired with this guest, I've seen a lot of people looking at this piece and trying to trying to get it. Well, and hey. Just so you know, everybody, I tried, I had a line on a couple of my little, my little, uh, well, hopefully maybe, no, yeah, I wasn't a guest, but those, those Rocky pieces that I mm-hmm. like, that I bought, you know what I mean? I, I, there's a Charlie Brown one I was trying to go back and the guy sold it yesterday. So I yep. think maybe somebody caught on to my yep. that's, so. that's what happens. That's what happens. Yeah, here we go. We got the legend in the saying. building. What's up, uh? We got Frank in here. What's going on? Uh, yeah, yeah, Speaking yeah. of another angel, and he shall appear. Now, <laughs> I did have I did have one more kind of mail day, but this is this is more. I want to I'm going to customize it. But I have a question. This is this is one of my favorite bobble, and and it's a and it sucks because that's it's cool. That's piece. badass. But it, it's, it's that's my, badass. By far, one of my favorites, and 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 but. It, I want to know if anybody's ever custom one of these because um, they're so glossy and so, you know what I mean? Um, I, I just want to know, and if so, can somebody hit me up and kind of, or even talk on the chat, like give me some kind of pointers. I was going to uh, primer it and kind of like uh, wipe it down and try to get as much gloss off as I can and try to do that. But I want to turn this into an A's, yeah. the whole poster. I just love this thing. And I know it's a little dated now, but I just love it. I, where, I where'd you, where, who, who is that supposed to be? But, Oh okay. Hulkbuster. It, it's it's from the I have a uh, I hate to admit it, but I have a um, an Iron Man signed by uh, by what's his name? Uh huh. Uh, Stan Lee. I have an Iron Man signed signed by Stan Lee as well, and um, that wet sand. I know that's what I was thinking too. That I get uh, like gloss off so and forth. But um, but I can't customize that that that. Uh, Iron Man, because like I said, it's autographed by Stan Lee, but uh, but still, I can do these. I, I, the The Giants made the best, and these yeah. are DNA, which is pretty good. But they made the best, yep. in my opinion, of the Marvel pieces. Um, even uh, uh, the Thor, I like the Thor that they made. That was a hell of a nice Thor. And in the um, even the uh, what's the what's the raccoon from uh, um, Guardians of the Galaxy? The him too. That one was you know, if, if you were to call him a raccoon, you know, and if it was a real like in real life, he would be so pissed off at you because that's his pet peeve. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. His name's Rocket, by the way. I think. 
Yeah, yeah, I agree. And Mike said the Batman sucked. It was sucked. Yeah. But the uh, Rocket, that's his name. But the but the Marvel but the Marvel pieces were good. The DC pieces, I agree, they weren't that great. But I like that Thor, and I love this Hulk Buster. And that'd be a to me a really hard custom, but I'll try it one day. But I'll wet yeah. something down. It's gonna be a lot of work. If so in mail, but it's you. That's uh, a, that's some pretty awesome melodies. Um, so uh, I don't know if you guys are okay with going into what things uh, collectors should be looking out for. Um, so guys, just so you know, we, we are able to, um, share this information with you guys. Uh, this is probably the first, uh, you guys will be hearing of it. And then you guys definitely, definitely, uh, will be seeing it in later days. And I'm very, very excited that, uh, this is probably the first time you guys are going to hear this. So tomorrow there's, uh, Ted DiBiase, uh, bobblehead drop with Foco. Which is like bad as I cannot wait. No, I want to know if he has the million dollar belt. That's gonna be sick. I don't, I don't think that like I just I'm just I'm replaying his uh, intro music in my head over and over and over. Oh my he gosh! That, he had that laugh, right? Like uh... yeah. <laughs> Everybody got a price. And yeah. Yeah. Yep. Virgil, dude, if they had a that'd be sick, yeah. Dude, that'd be sick. Yeah, that'd be badass. That'd be badass. So, man. Yeah, that little yep. boat so you stuff. guys heard it here yeah. first. Uh, tomorrow, uh, there will be a WWE Ted Deb- uh, Ted DiBiase uh, bobblehead drop. So definitely look out for that one, guys. Holy shit! I'm like, I'm I'm excited. I'm excited for it. Dude. That's gonna be that's gonna be lit. That's gonna and be then, uh, that's gonna so be for lit. all all my uh, Angelinos, and you know what's crazy? For um, us LA fans, I don't think there's a lot of LA fans who um, Mark he, he has the belt. Yes. Let's go. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Everybody. Uh, and, and then for all my uh, um, Angelinos out here, not a lot of LA people that I know are Rams fans. However, for those Rams fans, uh, there's going to be a, a set coming soon uh, for the, the championship uh, moment series um, for the Rams. So that's going to that's gonna be pretty exciting stuff. I, I think for me personally, uh, the bobblehead that I would probably get if they do drop something would probably be one of the mascots. I, that's probably like the only thing that I would get. Just because it's L.A., I'm not a Rams fan myself. I'm a Saints fan. And out here in L.A., there's a lot of uh, um, Raiders fans. There's a lot of Niners fans. Um, you know, it kind of just goes all over the place. So, yeah. And then there's a lot of Charger fans out here as well. I think there's more Raider fans um, out here than anything else. Same thing with, like, with, with Cowboy fans as is well. It? Like, it, it, yeah, it's, it's very, very interesting yeah. out here in L.A. So... Is there an increase in charges? Uh, no, 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 not not that I've seen. I, I think more so now. I think the Rams definitely have the Chargers um, out here. So, hey, yo, Gruff says go Cowboys. But uh, yeah, no, I, they're growing up. All my all my buddies, like everybody, so they're they're one of three fans: Niners, Cowboys, or Raiders. That's it. That's it. And then I was only oddball growing up when I was a kid. I actually grew up liking the Broncos because I went uh, I went to school out in Granada Hills and John Elway uh, went to Granada High School. Um, so I was a Broncos fan, and then I kind of converted to a Saints fan as soon as I went to Ken- so I went to Kennedy High School out in the San Fernando Valley, and like their colors kind of portrayed the same like almost like the Saints. And I was like, you know what? Yeah. So I kind of just went I went over. Gotcha. Uh, and shifted over to the to the Saints. So this is before Reggie Bush. This is before Drew Brees. You know, so kind of fell into that. Which is yeah, yeah. So it's pretty cool. So I'm pretty excited for the the Rams uh, Super Bowl champion moments uh, coming up. Well, who was that quarterback? He went to the Raiders after. Um, uh, that was his name uh, from the Saints, and then he went over to the Raiders. Oh, What's the question? And, I'm, anyways, I just watched anyway, A's blow before stage. Brees. God damn it. Man. <laughs> oh yeah, they're not- Blue Trevino sucks, dude. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. 
Well, he's got a he's got a bobblehead at least from the ports. <laughs> no, <I'm not> <laughs> Mike said he went to Kennedy High School in the Bronx. That's where we're, we're, we're homies, Mike. <laughs> I mean. Yeah, and uh, I we I'm just up. I got a little bit of a country town uh, high school I went to. So, but yeah, no, nah, I don't know the um, the Rams have a decent following though. I mean, they used to, and then when they left, it seemed they lost a lot of it. I feel like it, uh, it's getting it's getting bigger uh, again now since they won the this this championship. There's a there's a I hate to say this, man. I, I don't want to sound like a dick or anything, but there's a lot of bandwagon fans out there. So you know, and, and you know, but it, you know what? But this is what I say: it's like, it's a good win for LA. You know, I, I'm happy. I'm happy. LA got a, another yeah. title out here, and that's great. It's good to see. Um, hey, hey, I wish we had bandwagon fans in Oakland. We we get that. You know, we get bigger crowds and stuff. I mean, bandwagon helps. You know what I mean? I, I mean, I don't like it, yeah. but at least it helps a little bit. It's better than. 30,000, you know, we don't get 30,000 yeah. to stay a game ever, so, but, not so then, I mean, that, that's uh, the next thing that, that are coming up with Foco, and uh, I'm gonna let you guys say the, 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 the big, big news uh, towards the end, I'm gonna let uh, Mark say that one and announce it, because I know you're excited about it, um, but the, the next thing that's coming up also, they have the MLB Rookie Series, that actually starts next month. So that that's going to be pretty exciting as well. Um, yeah, I wonder who. Yeah, that'd be interesting. So, I wonder if it's going to be last year rookies or what. Well, Foco's in here, so we can ask the questions. Maybe, maybe Foco can let us know. Yeah, I'd like to know what kind of names going to be on that. I mean, you know, I, I guess it's going to be hard. I'm not going to tell us who exactly but i'd just like to know if a little bit of you know, yeah, and then, uh they, they did mention that the numbering will be uh, on the smaller size and uh, this is a new series uh that they will be adding yearly so uh, yeah that's a good yeah idea. it's, it's always like better to have a smaller size in production with uh some of these bobbleheads uh rookies for this year oh, yeah. this year 10 to 15 guys okay oh that, that, that that's a, yeah that's exciting Dang. stuff And uh, I'm not, not going to be eight, guys, I'm sure. Uh, <laughs> um, and then we, I saw what they're bringing out some, we saw some Tiger Woods. We saw the Tiger Woods last week with the Masters. That's what they're they saying. More of those, right? Oh, 72 pieces. 72 pieces on the Yeah, yeah that's, that's very, that's very limited. limited. Holy shit. Wow. That's cool. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. I doubt there's an A's one in there, but that'd be that'd be cool. Right? Maybe we had a Pache. Who knows? Uh, yeah. So the Tiger Woods, that's gonna be pretty interesting. I, I those are pretty yeah, clean. That was a pretty awesome. good looking piece they had last time, but that's gonna be cool. To get that a was bit really cool. On that. We got one and, more, uh, Mark. You wanna you here? wanna say that one? Yeah, I'll say it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Finally, dude, he's he's getting uh, Bobble from Foco, Griffey Jr. Woo! Ken Griffey Jr. I'm yeah. pumped for that. So, so I've been looking at so there's a um, there's a, a big head Griffey on eBay. I've been watching and watching and watching, but, but man, that's why. Man, I know this is gonna end up me buying these other team things and doing these little sets of this certain type thing. I know this is gonna happen, but I can't wait to see a Griffey a... piece, man. That's gonna. Be so Dude, did you guys? Have, did you guys see the? Uh... Did you guys see the uh, Griffey, um, Jackie Robinson one that the Mariners just put out? The statue? The statue or? Yes, I feel like I. Uh, no, it was a bobblehead. Really? Yeah, just I think it was this past weekend. Was really? Nice. And he's wearing he's wearing forty two on his back. It's oh, really- so it's Griffey wearing a Jackie Robinson jersey? Ah, yeah. it's really oh shit. Sorry, A's lost. Fucking A's. Uh, Griffey has two forever big heads. It's, Ooh, it's really nice, dude. It. Yeah, uh, that's what Bravo just uh, put. He probably had. Knowing Bravo, he has them. Yeah. See, I I think I'm gonna get caught in the in the. Damn it! I know I'm gonna get caught. Yes. In the they're the they're head amazing head. pieces, man. Look. I, not, I, 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 I want them all. 
This piece here? Yeah, that's it. Is uh, that there might be on the back. Two, I saw a different color jersey. 42 Griffey 42 Bobble is out now. Wait, where? Bravo, you gotta get you got you gotta get well, me one, Bravo. Said they haven't come out yet. I could have sworn I saw him in a in a in a navy. Oh, it's a, they're already being sold on eBay. I could have sworn I saw him in a navy blue top. Yeah, they're already on eBay right now for fifty bucks, sixty bucks, that, seventy bucks. Oh, I'm looking at everything. Yeah, that was an eBay. Anyway, so it's it's very nice. It's oh very yeah, they, they already have them in hand. Oh yeah, here check this out. Oh okay, the sixteenth. Here we got a Mar we got Mariners bobbles in here. The sixteenth is the SGA, so that's Saturday. Yeah, I showed. Yeah, right. dude, it's it's and a really nice piece. looking. Well, piece. So, someone already has it in hand. Well, I think there's a pre-sale, which is which again is a a joke. Oh, that's a nice piece, man. Yeah, it's very nice. That yeah, tells me. You know, they should... How about that? How about a Jackie Robinson I, Day series? You know what I mean? Everybody I, in their Jackie Robinson... I would love... That, that would be badass. Team, that would be badass. That? Every single team would do that. That's Foco. Yeah. Put it in the bubble tank. I don't... I don't do the other... Hey, I like that. That's a good little series. It could be a Jackie series or Jackie Robinson series. And do it with... That, that's a good idea. And do it with Roberto Clemente, too. I love that too. kind of stuff. Because they have the... The yeah. Roberto Clemente Award winner every year win, uh, wears 21 during their game when they're honored. And that would be mm -hmm. a really cool bobblehead for each team's Roberto Clemente representative, too. Yep, yep. Yeah. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Tank tonight. Damn. Put it together. Right. We're just doing things tonight. Look at that. Dude, I would I would love that. I Because... So I don't. So I like a lot of game use stuff, but I don't like game use uh, Jackie jerseys or Jackie Robinson jerseys because they're all the same. So it's hard to tell that you know. What I mean, if I buy a Sean Murphy one, it doesn't look like Sean Murphy. It just says forty two on, which is it's fine. But you know, what I mean, yeah. that would be sick as a bobble. Yeah, I, that's a great, so a so. Uh, Fogel said that the Robinson family is very particular about what is allowed to be made, which is understandable. I, I'm not asking. The well, forty-two. I'm, I'm saying the MLB forty-two jerseys. I, I'm not saying. I, I wonder if that could be a. You know, what I mean, I'm not. Saying yeah, if it's, if, it's, if it's just a forty-two, it then it has nothing Robinson about it. Yeah, no, that's true. Right. I mean, they don't have. They, they don't own the rights to the number forty-two, do they? Well, Major League Baseball retired the number, so there might be something tied to that. Mm. But you could ask. You could ask MLB. You know, what I mean. So speaking of that, so two. All right, so Bible Bro is not on here, but he. If, I, know, <laughs> to, I get a little sidetracked. <coughs> side so last me. year, last year this came out. Look, at, it says Athletics. It doesn't say Stomper, right? Yeah. It says Athletics. Oakland Athletics. Nothing about Stomper. Now, Tops released baseball cards. It says Oakland A's mascot. It doesn't say Stomper. The other Tops. Masks have their names on it. Is there something going on with the name Stomper that we can't use? I, stomp? they can't I have a different Stomper baseball now card, a different Stomper baseball card that doesn't say Stomper on it. I don't know. That's weird. So what's up with that? But there's other. I mean, I, I feel like conspiracy theory stuff now, dude. So like, I I, I know I was kind of getting off of the tangent, but I'm and, and I know it's all has to do with licensing. That's why I'm bringing it all back. But isn't it that's odd? You know what I mean? Some odd things like that. And I would love, I don't know. I mean, I, that Jackie thing to me, I think that's yeah. a different thing. I, I don't know how it works if, Jack, if the Jackie Robinson family or foundation owns the number right. 42 in Major League Baseball. I mean, that would be cool but, to see, though. Because, but, like, I, even I, with that, so Frank just brought up another point. He said there's going to be a Hank Aaron and Jackie Robinson statue drop that's coming up by the Braves. Uh, by the way, Braves fans, if you guys are out there, if you guys uh, are going to the game, let me know. I will buy an extra ticket so you guys can send it to me. But, no, with that being said, I mean, if, if statues are being made, you know, why can't... Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, this one has either. it. Sorry, I got a question. Yeah, it's older. Yeah, that's older. Uh, 
I didn't mean to interrupt you. I saw a question that said the three foot has it on there, doesn't it? And it doesn't. No, the three footer doesn't. Oh, anyways. But yeah, I agree. But so what's what's the thing with So the, the Braves are the, dropping uh, the Jackie Robinson the, and Hank Aaron statue like uh you know, it's a two-piece set that kind of you know oh, go, yeah. goes together. Um, so they're they're dropping the statues pretty soon, and um, you know, I, I've only seen statues of Jackie being made because uh, the Dodgers have a statue, um, replica statue of uh, you know him sliding right. home. Um, there's a big statue outside of uh, uh, Dodger Stadium, and the Dodgers, you know, I don't know what year it was, but they they were giving that as a as a SGA. Um, several years back so that's all i've seen is just like um um jackie statues no bobbleheads or nothing obviously we, we got the pops this year which is pretty badass um but no it'd be it'd be great to see some bobbleheads man and especially you know, that that's a that's a that's another thing like retired jerseys and stuff like that like um you know jackie robinson day is like one of those like holidays in, in baseball and exactly to your guys' point, what greater way to celebrate a holiday, Jackie Robinson Day, with having all like say like I don't know for the for the Dodgers it'd be like I don't know uh, um, Kershaw if not maybe even uh, Mookie Betts with a forty two jersey bobblehead you know and same thing you know like all all like exactly. the big name players from each MLB team yeah um, wearing that the forty that that'd be pretty that yeah. that'd be insane. Well, it- It'd be like the it'd be the the, the Jackie Robinson on parade, yeah, the, or yeah. You know, Bobble on parade, or you know what I mean. I'm not, and I'm not trying to di- I'm not trying to diminish the Jackie Robinson thing. I'm trying to say yep. you can know, play yep. in what's happening because it's not be awesome. like I don't know what the you know we have no idea what the Robinson family's um, uh, reasoning is, yeah, or or whatever, but. I mean, like, I, I think I've talked about it on here before, but you guys know, like, my son's doing a um, project right now on it. He had to choose a great American hero to do a presentation on. He's doing Jackie Robinson. So we've been we've been learning a lot about Jackie Robinson the last couple of weeks. And although, like, a bobblehead like this would, like, you know, quench our thirst for as a collector, yeah. I mean, the, just the, like, just the, the, um, it continues to spread awareness uh, of yep. what what exactly Jack Robinson did, and that should be that should be more of like what um, what's behind it than just getting a collector's piece for for people, in my opinion. Because I mean, I've learned so much about Jackie Robinson in the last couple of weeks helping my kid with this, other than the fact that he was the first black baseball player. Like he's done so much more than that. That's what the message should right, be. Right. Same with yeah. Him. Like Clemente and, and Uncle. Well, then, then they, not even, so if there's like a, a thing where the family um, is making it a uh, making it difficult for anyone else to kind of produce something, why not call it instead of Jackie Robinson Day, call it Forty Two Day? You know, Forty Two right, Day right. Series. I, I, I but it, it's, yeah. it's going to come down to MLB though. It, it's not going to, you know. I mean, it, they're they're going to have to do the approval and they're going to have to be the one that be more diplomatic you know i mean their choices i i'm pretty sure but i but i, I don't see where i, I don't know I, you know it's like anything yeah it's like any you think about anything well i don't see any negative points but it probably is and maybe they don't like bobbleheads you know what i mean maybe they think it's a maybe they think it's a character joke of you know making fun of something maybe that's how they look at it. i don't know you know what i mean and, and so that that that's the whole thing they don't care about, but or they don't care for because there there isn't very no. many. No, yeah, the Sam's There's Sam's uh, one I I freaking slept on uh, uh, the listing. It sold for like one sixty or whatever, um, and, and I've seen them go for anywhere from two hundred to two fifty, two sixty, give or take, where people do buy it um, for around that price. And uh, I one sixty, I would have been I, I would have been all in on it. So one just sold not too long ago recently on eBay. I'm pretty sure we, I'm pretty sure they're out there for a lot cheaper, but I haven't really done a lot of research on that. But that's like the only bobble that I've seen that uh, other than like the the Nodders, you know, that that are out there they're supposedly a representation of Jackie Robinson or whatnot. Um but yeah, there there aren't many bobbleheads out there. And I don't think there are any um Jackie Robinson uh um but did, did, didn't uh, um the hall have something with him as well though? 
Because I, I saw I saw the whole the hall has something of, of him sitting in a chair or something. No, that's Satchel Page. No, hold on. I, I saw I, I I seriously saw uh, the hall have some like a Jackie Robinson bobblehead. They did a whole Negro League. I don't know set. Yeah. But I, I'm gonna get. I gotta find that Sam's guy. I'm gonna have him on here too. Yeah, I'm all in on that Sam's man. But uh, Bravo just said right now, uh, just an FYI for Griffey collectors for forever pieces. Uh, they have four Seattle's and six Reds. That and that that's forever collectible just mm-hmm, general correct. pieces, or is that? I'm going Bob. I'm going. So th- this one right here, it's, it's the Kansas Kansas Bravo. City. Uh, yeah, so the Negro League. Um. See, Bernie's parking. Uh, I didn't see yeah. that. I didn't see that. Okay. Okay. So that that's the only one that I see out, but he's not wearing obviously MLB stuff. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I like I said, maybe the family just thinks that it's a they're they're, you know, what I mean, it, maybe they think it's like making fun of people and that, you know, what I mean, there's it's it's there's clearly something probably there. more of. Major League Baseball just dropping the ball on yet another thing if I had to take a guess like so so much what golden opportunities past they're out of touch oh come on that's that's a bold statement (laughs) man I I cannot believe you said that sorry man Fred I don't know All right, boys. Well, anything else we want to hit up tonight? We hit our about an hour ish. We had no guests tonight. But yeah, no, just you know, just kind of to recap on on the information that's out there, guys. Tomorrow, WWE Ted DiBiase, uh, Bawa does launch tomorrow. Look out for the Rams uh, Super Bowl champs uh, moment series, uh, Red Sox and Houston Astros City Connect as well. Um, the MLB rookie series coming up starts next month. The big heads are in, guys. Uh, probably will be dropped after the All Star Game, and uh, there's more Tiger Woods stuff that will drop. And then, lastly, uh, Ken Griffey Jr. is launching, guys. So yeah. definitely, definitely look out for that stuff. Oh my God, I can't. Out of everything here, I- I'm stuck on Ken Griffey, guys. I don't know about you, but yeah. I'm, I'm I'm stuck. Big heads, Ken Griffey, Ted DiBiase. I, I, I'm all in. I'm all in. Um, yo, Angie, what's going on? Welcome in. Welcome yeah, in. Yeah. Good to see you. Good to see you. Uh, big personal mail day tomorrow, too. Ooh. Uh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh. You're going to do a live, uh, Bravo? Do a live on a Bravo? And by the way, look it. out for this giveaway, guys. This Duke Snyder St. Paul Saints uh, bobblehead. Um, that we will be giving away relatively soon, guys. This is a big piece that you guys have to and have then, in your collection. And another note: so next week I'm gonna try if I can get everybody to follow us through the the. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Foco, for the A's ball list. Thank you. I I will I'll kiss the ground you walk on. The more you can give us. Um, I, I'm gonna do the live from the bobble the the bobble talk. Uh, uh, Instagram next week. I'm gonna give everybody fair warning. I'll keep posting it and and linking it, and I'll put the, the QR code. But I'm gonna be trying to. I'm gonna do the live from that. I'm gonna do everything so that everything follows into that into that uh, that account. And I want to thank everybody for. Uh, if you would please go subscribe on YouTube and stuff. I'll keep everything up there so we have a database. Why? Know, whatever. Oh and thank you, Paco. But thank you, everybody. Yeah. Uh, everybody's support yeah so yeah big stuff guys thank you so much everybody that tapped in like uh rob said we uh do have a youtube well we also have a facebook group now we just started fa- yeah we're gonna yeah 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 so we'll start inviting media media people in there too so yeah, yeah we, we have twitter <laughs> uh facebook and youtube now guys uh what's next yeah and if you can't if you can't find it <laughs> it's your fault not our fault <laughs> and we're here every Tuesday to talk to you as well, yeah. so don't blame us for nothing. So. All right, I uh, thank you, everybody. Uh, thank you, boys. I appreciate your your time tonight. Um, next week we'll have a guest, and we'll be back um, and hit it hard. I will continually post in the story and on Twitter and everything 
for the new account for Instagram. We'll go live from that next week. So please pay attention on that as well. Peace. Right. Thank you, everybody.